Oh, good morning, everyone. Uh, it's October the 9th. Uh, I got an interesting one uh, for you today. Um, there's a nest, uh, the guy said it's in a boxwood shrub. Um, their neighbor noticed it when they said they saw bees flying in and out of it uh, a little while back. Uh, maybe the guy got stung, he got too close, I guess, and then uh, they called me. And the neighbor was allergic, but the guy was going to originally wait until, uh, I guess, the winter time and then just dig the whole shrub up, but doesn't want to take the chance, doesn't want to wait um, another month or so, so he just wants to uh, have me come out and just uh, get rid of it today. So In a quarter mile, yeah. turn left onto Bell Tavern Road. This is not going to be a vacuum job. It's going to be uh, spray with soapy water and fog. This is in there. See it? It's their entry on the top. They have a lot of small holes in these nests that they use. Not like a not like a bald-faced hornet nest that has just one, usually one opening at the bottom. These have a lot of small holes throughout. The customer got stung trying to poke the bush with a stick, but I'm gonna get paid more for this. But uh, actually, I'm gonna kill the nest and then dig up the bush. And then I fill it in, so doing a little landscaping too. Customer wanted the, uh, the shrub out, so that's what we did. That's what I did. Wasn't that hard. Um, the wasp expert Herx a landscaper today. Uh, I was paid well for this because um, obviously it's going beyond what I normally do. Um, but yeah, the, the bitch of it was just getting this stump out because it was really rooted. I had to dig and then I had to use these uh, pruners to uh, cut the roots. But uh, this is the nest he got. Well, he's got about nine or ten levels. Some of them broke up, but it was a big nest. They poked it with a stick, um, the shrub with a stick, and then uh, of course they swarmed out and they chased the guy into the house. So, pretty much uh, contained now. It's just uh, some foragers coming back, but I'll take care of those. And then I uh, fill in this area. And I got a bunch of garbage bags for putting all this stuff away. I mean, I'll take an after photo once all this is cleaned up, but just want to get done with this and get on with my weekend. All right, bye bye. My take at landscaping. Now the guy can uh, decide what kind of bush he wants to plant in its place.